I've been wanting to bring this series back for a very long time and I'll finally be doing so today. So what's going on everyone? My name is Optimus and today we will be covering Domination and Modern Warfare Remastered. I've decided to do these videos because for one, Black Ops 3 and Modern Warfare Remastered are totally different games and two, you guys seem to really enjoy these videos back during that game's life cycle. So make sure that if you do enjoy today's videos or it helps elevate your game to drop a like on today's video, share it, subscribe if you're brand new around here, and let's get into today's video. So we'll start off with a quick overview of Domination. It's no different than any other game. There are three flags, A, B, and C, with A and C usually close to both spawns. Score limit is 200, with 100 being the halftime point, and team to get to 200 first or the team with the most points when time runs out is declared the winner. Now that we have that established, Let's go over some tips. Tip number one is to learn your spawn grenades. Most Call of Duty maps have some place where you can throw spawn grenades, but the best ones are in Modern Warfare Remastered and COD 4. A lot of these maps, all you have to do is walk forward about 20 feet and throw a grenade over a building, and you can get up to like two or three easy kills right out of the gates, and that does throw off the enemy team and gets you kills. You can use this also to clear off objectives and defend the objective. You can even use grenade routes to attack objectives, especially if the enemies are camping. Tip number two is to learn your capture spots. COD 4 maps have been notoriously featuring spots on domination points that can make a person who's capturing it either insanely hard to see or protected by cover. Two of the most notorious spots are in pipeline like here. You can crawl under this train cart, still be able to shoot at defenders, and still get the capture usually undetected. Now the other one is here in vacant. You'll see here on the A flag you can crawl into this side of a crate. You'll have a really good shot at getting the capture unless you don't crawl back far enough and maybe get seen. This is a good tactic to use, but you have to be aware because COD4 veterans already probably know about this and they usually do know all of the spots because they've been playing it for 10 years, so you have to watch out for that. Tip number three is to build your perks around the gun you're using. Now, I don't think sniping is a very good thing to do in Domination, but if you can pull it off, you should automatically be using stopping power. You're not getting those one-hit shots. Same thing if you want easy one bursts with the M16 or easy kills with the AK-47. Stopping power is great. For weapons like the AK-74U and the MP5, you can get away with using Juggernaut, but you should probably not be running overkill, usually in any circumstance, because it's really a waste of the best perk slot in the game. Of course, you are going to get an extra weapon but you're not going to be able to get the damage buff or the health buff with stopping power or juggernaut you could even use like sonic boom and that can help your explosives have a like greater blast radius and that helps you get more damage and even more kills but anyway bandolier is also another one of my favorite perks my favorite perk one and my favorite perk three that i typically do go with is steady aim so if you want to make sure your perks align do that with your weapon pick to keep it short and sweet, those are three tips for you to get better at domination and get more XP. You can rank up faster, you can perform better, get more kills. Whatever you're looking to do in domination, these three things will help you maximize that potential. If you'd like to see a video that's way more in-depth on domination, if you'd like to see a video on like spawn grenade routes or even capture points, make sure to let me know down in the comments. If you did enjoy, make sure to drop a like and share this video. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, this is Optimus, signing out.